What do you know of hysteria? Nothing. But half the women in London are affected. It's a plague of our time. I have just been offered a position by London's leading specialist in women's medicine. Oh, no. I must find some way to attend to these women properly. I believe the French have had quite a bit of luck using their tongue. No, no. I want you to meet my daughter, Emily Dalrymple. A servant, ma'am. I've no doubt that one day she would make a fine doctor's wife. It's a very difficult case, that one. Oh! 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 It must be difficult pleasuring half the women in the city. Pleasure has nothing to do with it, I can assure you. Well, I suppose that depends on whether you're over the table or on it. Isn't she a Chinese firecracker? According to your diagnosis, hysteria seems to cover everything from insomnia to toothache. My new generator. My God. <laughs> now, who should we try it on? <laughs> What do you call that little thing? Well, I was calling it the feather duster. Think of something quick, so the girl knows what to ask for. Women will no longer be denied our rightful place. There's all... <laughs> you are a confounding woman. And you are a good doctor, and you should remain one. Whether you seek it or not, Dr. Granville, you are destined for fame. You're gonna need a bigger appointments book.